A Chicken Filet franchisees must be free of any other business ventures. That's why this sucks. The company wants their franchisees to be completely hands-on, just like a job, and devoted solely to their Chicken Filet franchise, just like a job. In other words, if you're a serial entrepreneur, this is not the right franchise for you. So yes, this can make a boatload of money, but you are still shackled and chained as if you had a nine to five. This is just disguised as a freedom for you guys. All right, this is anti job university welcome to this channel where we help you reveal your passion in order to cash in we're going to go over the franchise of chick-fil-a which is the most profitable franchise out there right now but is it your way to unshackle yourself and gain freedom from your nine to five job all right is it is this a way okay so we're going to review is a couple channels that's reviewed this chick-fil-a franchise but my channel is all about helping you reveal your passion in order to cash in if you're concerned with becoming a restaurateur, I'm still going to show you some stuff about this that you might be concerned about before you make a decision. It's 10 grand and you can make that back within a couple of months and get an awesome return with a chicken filet franchise. But, but before you go and do that, it's some concerns we need to discuss. All right. So chicken filet is a tasty deal with a franchise fee of only 10 grand, but is it worth the strict restrictments? All right. Is it, is it worth the strict requirements and lengthy approval process? So what are they talking about? All right. It's not like you can just go and drop 10 grand at a store and get your own Chick-fil-A. That's not how this works. OK, um, there's there's an approval process. There's over 40,000 applicants each year. So if you're interested in the Chick-fil-A franchise, there's plenty of people that's interested in this. So but the problem is they want you to be on the plantation the same way that you would be on a plantation at your nine to five job. So this is what I'm talking about. I'm talking about business opportunities disguised as freedom, disguised as entrepreneurship, but is really just another a chain to put on you so yes you get certain benefits like you can have bragging rights of telling people that you own a, a chick-fil-a down the street but you really don't own anything watch this look all right look pay attention before you go watch this all right the initial franchise fee for chick-fil-a is only 10 grand this is relatively low all right averages upwards of 40k with other franchises such as taco bell and mcdonald's so look the roses in the sunshine and all of that stuff is awesome but keep watching keep watching because i got something for you okay the franchise fee is low because the company wants to maintain ownership of the franchise and making all purchase decisions okay the initial investment is right within the industry average okay so this is what i'm talking about they want to maintain ownership of the franchise so a lot of different franchises that you can buy into you actually become like a, a real owner you know but with chicken filet you're not really becoming an owner for real it's an illusion in your mind designed to make you feel good the same way as when you had that job they would give you a manager position and you would feel like you're in charge of something but you're really not in charge of anything all right, the average Chick-fil-A restaurant produces 5.3 million in gross annual sales. That sounds good, but remember, you still don't own anything, and I'm, I'm about to show you how much you get out of that 5.3 million, okay? Is it worth it? Keep watching, okay? So gross sales and net operating income are two different things. Keep watching. All right, so the take-home average annual income will be around 120K. I can show you how to make 120K in a month easy okay and your name will be on your business and it will be from your passion all right book a call link in the description okay but anyway we're gonna get to it so as far as franchises go that's not bad especially in your first year okay so the franchisor does all the work as far as choosing the location and all of that so that's one of the benefits that they make it seem like okay yeah all right turnover is low there is little risk which is a dream come true from any business person so remember you're not really a business person if you're not the owner okay so they drop these terminologies to make you really feel like you're doing something so you can drop that ten thousand dollars okay you don't want to get played right Nobody in here wants to get played. All right, there are many reasons a franchise might not be the right opportunity for you. You don't agree with their policies or morals. So another thing, which I ain't mad at, but they don't like the LGBTQ and sometimes Y community and all of that. So if you're a part of that, you're if you want to be down with bad boy, then F you too. Chino XL, F you too. They roll like Tupac pretty much. So if you, if you get a franchise, that means you're not down with the alphabet community as well. All right, whether you want to say that or not, okay? So look, Chicken filet franchisees must be free of any other business ventures. Look, if you're really trying to become an entrepreneur, set yourself free from your nine to fives and everything, then owning a franchise, especially a franchise from uh, Chick-fil-A might not be the right thing to do, okay? The company wants their franchisee to be completely hands-on and solely devoted Ah, so they're a chicken filet franchise. This means you are supposed to be working just like a manager over hours, over hours and everything like that, making a lot of decisions, being there on location. You cannot outsource this. You cannot 
hire somebody to be over this location while you go on vacation and all of that extra stuff like your dreams. That's what you think, but no. Burst the bubble right here. They want you actually there. Okay, so that's why I says if you're a serial entrepreneur or somebody that has other dreams, if you wanted to open a different type of restaurant or if you wanted to go open a ballet studio or, or, or a movie theater or whatever, blah, 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 then you wouldn't be able to do that. So you're locked in at a dang on um, uh, salary once again. It's jobs that can pay you $150 a, uh, annually. That's $150,000 annually. So that's not even enough, right? Okay, so I mean, I want you to be completely hands on. Okay, so with all of that restriction, then they have a very selective process. So I'm not trying to rag on uh, Chick-fil-A franchise opportunity or anything like that. But my, my thing is anti-job university YouTube channel. Our goal is to help you reveal your passion in order to cash in, not shackle yourself to something else that you're going to feel like you're freaking in jail, feel like you're uh, in hell, feel like you can't exhale or you can't exit. Okay. I want you to be able to uh, make money, but be free at the same time, free to do whatever the hell you want to do. There's other franchise opportunities with more freedom, but this is one of the top ones that pay you the most. But remember, like I said, it, with your passion, I can show you how to make 120K per month with your own actual passion, putting your name in it, LLCs, ownership, all of that stuff. You know what I'm saying? And it don't have to take a, a dang on year. All right. And you don't have to like sign over your life. So out of the frying pan into the fire. I know you heard that before. So the goal is not for me to help you leave your job only to go and put another chain of a yoke of iron around your neck with this type of franchise. The goal is for you to leave your job and to never go into something where you feel like you have to run away from it again. Okay. So if you're new to the channel, do a gently sidekick to the like button. I am going to say that I wouldn't recommend you buy a Chick-fil-A franchise, even though it's only 10 grand and you can make that back real fast and all of that. First of all, you have to get through the obstacle of even getting approved, whether or not you have the money or not. Okay. So very strict, man, very strict, but use your passion to cash in. Go to the link in the description or text that number, text passion to the number that you see in the description and we'll get you set up and we'll get you going with a business that you own, that you come up with. All right.